big one. Mark. Hey guys, I'm Miranda Cosgrove and I play Carly Shay. Uh, hello, I am Jerry Trainer and I play Spencer on iCarly. What's up everybody, Nathan Kress here, Freddy on, well, iCarly, but also this. Hi, my name is Lacey Mosley and I play Harper, Carly's best friend. Hi guys, I'm Jaden and I play Millicent on iCarly. This, this new thing, this new thing that's happening. Years later, I will continue to play Spencer, it turns out. So here we are. Time is a flat circle. <laughs> Welcome. I'm happy that you're here. Because of COVID and everything, the first table read was over Zoom, but it was still really fun and it was awesome just getting to get the gang back together again and see everyone and step back into these characters. Are we all looking at the same thing? The big old pile of crap? <laughs> it's art. Not everyone has to like it. Why don't you like it? I clicked right out of this email. Harper, I gotta know! Why don't you like my sculpture, please? <laughs> Bye, okay, okay. One second. How does it feel to be back on set? Uh, it feels very strange, because uh, it was unexpected. Man, this whole thing has just been such a blast and so surreal to be doing something that feels very familiar um, in, a, in a lot of ways, but also very new and very different, and I think uh, as far as the fans at home are concerned, very unexpected. Coming to iCarly got me super excited because it feels so nostalgic to be like, to be on these sets that are, you know, designed so much like the original and seeing like these, uh, like, like the soda can guy is here, like stuff that I've seen as a child, like in person is so cool. It's really fun actually, like everybody is so nice and I've been on a lot of like different shows that have negative energy and here it's just so positive and everyone's so nice. I don't want to give too much away, but you know, I don't, I don't think a, a, a reboot or a revival has been done quite like this where something that was so sort of geared towards young people is now 10 years later, we're aiming at those same people that grew up with the show and, and it's like, what of the characters' lives turned out to be, maybe not what we expected, um, which is how real life happens. On this new version of iCarly, it's definitely made with the people in mind who loved this show from before. So it's been really fun getting to make a more mature, kind of elevated version of the old iCarly and just see what these characters are doing now that they're in their 20s. This version is super dope because now we're all millennials, you know what I mean? So we have jobs, we have grown up problems, and it's fun to see these fun characters like as adults. We're, we're doing something that uh, we hope will feel very comfortable and like putting on a fuzzy blanket, but in a way that uh, shakes things up a little bit. I can't talk to him. I'm just, it's a disaster. I'm not dating, I'm not making videos. I'm just too embarrassed about my life. And you should be. Your legs look like Eugene Levy's eyebrows. You said that was feminist. I lied. Who can I trust? Carly. Missing the cast is a nuanced position. Sometimes you just need space from your family. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I missed everyone so much. Yeah, it's just been great getting to be with Nathan and Jerry. I mean, they're honestly two of my oldest friends. The best part of coming back is is obviously seeing Miranda and Nathan and I've kept in touch all these years. They're so grown up now. Nathan's wife is about to have a baby and so we're going to get to be around during all that, which is going to be really fun. We get to see each other, we saw each other pretty regularly, uh, pre-pandemic, of course, but there's been a long period of not getting to see each other, obviously, with everything that's gone on in the world. So getting to reunite in this way has been uh, very unexpected. It's just been awesome hanging out with Jerry. He is a very good listener, I'll give him that. <laughs> Everyone is so fun, everyone is so nice, funny. Jerry is super annoying, by the way. Can't even stand him. But, you know, he's fun to work with. Everybody is super fun to work with. And, you know, it's all just a fun relationship. We were, I think, all nervous. Like, what is this gonna be? Are we gonna, are we gonna still have it? As soon as the three of us got on stage together, it was like, we were the same. I'm just messing with them, making jokes. We're just ripping on each other. It's like nothing changed. It's uh, that has been a blast and and a real a real treat. The interactions have been great. Uh, it just feels like coming home.
It's so interesting joining this cast because I obviously watched iCarly as a child growing up and never thought that I would actually somehow end up on the show. Um, the cast is super nice and it feels like I've known them forever, which is fun to me because they've known each other for so long. I feel really included and everyone's super nice. It's been a it's been a very strange mix of emotions and feelings, um, but it's all it's all good stuff. It's all very exciting. Uh, and I think people are gonna be pretty psyched about this when they get to see a little bit more. There's something for everybody in this show. If you were an old stan of the show, there's tiny little Easter eggs and jokes that you'll hear that you'll love and you'll remember from the original. And if you're new, then you get to see these grown up adults, you know, act so silly and have a good time. And it's just a fun show to watch and chill. I can't wait for you guys to see me on the new iCarly. I gotta go finish filming, so I'll see you guys later. Bye.